All right, welcome back to Ragdown Planting. So today, ladies and gentlemen, I will be repotting my Hoya plants. This is a six inch pot, my new plant. And what caught my eye about this plant are the leaves and the stems. So I took the time to look up the name of the shape of the leaf and it's called Lancia, Lancio Lada. It's Spanish. And the gardener told me the more light I present to this plant, the more colors I will receive. Not so much sun, because that will harm the leaves. She is a particular plant. The leaves are striking. The Hoya. So I have to wash it out my pot. There's already a hole at the bottom. It's time to apply my screen and also my rocks for my drainage. So because this plant do have stringy like vines, I must be careful while breaking up the soil just so I don't mix up the rooting system too bad. And I'm doing that by going from the bottom to the top. Being very careful not to separate the leaves because they are easy it seems that for them to come apart. So I'm doing my best to make sure these roots are covered. Again, the, the vines are separating from the soil. And as I put the soil into the pot, I t just take my fingers and like sweep the soil into the middle of the plant.
All right, so after that quick wipe down one, two, any nastiness in the soil from the garden shop goes straight to the garbage. And for my ending result, let's get into our business. The lanceolata leaves are beautiful. But there is a root out of the soil here. So I will have to go back and secure that. But other than that, the drainage is good. The soil is good. At this time, the plant is sunken into the pot, and I did that on purpose, just low into the pot. But eventually, the leaves will cascade over the pot. This is not a fussy plant. I can put it on a regular watering cycle and just allow the soil to dry out between waterings. 